All right. So let me share my screen. Okay. I kind of wanted it over here though. Um, anyhow, so what Punchlet does is we make the repair process simple for agents and their clients. Um, we do pre-list. So if you have a seller that wants to do some repairs up front prior to putting the home on the market, they can go ahead and get the repairs done up front and then pay through closing. So there's no out-of-pocket expenses. Um, we also do Binzer repairs and post-closing. So if you have a seller, maybe they don't want to um, do the repairs, but they're willing to issue a credit to the buyer through closing. Um, we can work with the buyer once the property closes. Um, a lot of times buyers will walk into a property and they like it, but they know right away they want to do kitchen or bathroom remodels. Um, so we can uh, work with them on that as well. So basically, we just make the inspection and pre-list repairs and renovations easy. Um, this is one of my favorite slides. So whether it's the agent trying to source and schedule or whether it's the client, uh, we take that hassle away. So your client's working with one company rather than trying to source and schedule with multiple contractors. Um, so basically our mission is to champion and empower homeowners through innovation solutions. We do offer a 5% discount to all NAR members. We do price match guarantee. So if you do get an estimate or your client gets an estimate that comes in lower, um, we'd be happy to match it. And most of the time we actually beat the price by five to 10%. We um, also, like I mentioned, do all the work up front. So there is no out-of-pocket expenses. And then we do issue a one-year transferable warranty. So the warranty stays with the home on all um, material and labor that we provide. So even if the contractor you know, retired, the warranty is through punch list. So we'll honor that and schedule someone else to go out there and, and <clears throat> complete the work or repair uh, the initial work. We offer free next day estimates. Um, it's all streamlined online booking. And we have all of our licensed pros or all of our pros are licensed, insured. They're vetted, they're background checked. They actually go through a whole punch list training. Um, they have the punch list app on their phone. So when they get to the project, they check in. Um, so we know where they're at at all times. Um, we have a dedicated support and management team. So you'll be working or your client will be working with a customer sales manager who will do all the sourcing and stay in contact with them. So they're going to have one contact throughout the whole project. And it's easy as creating your user profile. You want to make sure if you are a member of NAR that you put in your nerds number when you create the profile. And that's going to ensure that um, anytime you create a new estimate, that discount will automatically reflect so you don't have to do anything else. Um, and then you'll upload an inspection report or your binzer. The next day we provide the free online estimate and it's an interactive estimate, right? So you can go on there, you can play with it, you can sort it by... Um, the major repairs, you can sort it by um, roofing, electrical, um, and then you can also delete line items. So if you upload the whole inspection report, but you only want maybe the items that are on the Binzer, um, you can either put notes in up front to the estimating team, you know, please quote the Binzer items only, or if you want to see, you know, what the entire um, repair list would look like, then you can delete line items as you go along. <clears throat> or if you share it with your client and they're like, no, I'm not fixing that, go ahead and delete it. The line item stays there, but adjust the estimate total real time. You can also share it with your buyers, you can share it with your sellers, or you can share it with the agents on the other side of the transaction. Um, sometimes agents use this as a negotiating, right? A contract negotiating tool. Um, and other times um, they'll use it to share with the, the listing agent, right? So they can go ahead and get the repairs done up front. Um, 
And like I said, you'll have a dedicated success manager that's going to coordinate all the sourcing, all the scheduling. And then once the project's completed, we send out our territory manager and they're going to take pictures. They're going to make sure that the work is done and completed um, before the project is even closed. And um, like I mentioned before, we do issue the one year warranty. So here's what I was talking about is kind of an interactive estimate. Um, so you can do your sorting, you can remove. Um, once the client approves the line items, so you're going to approve it, but you're not approving payment, right? Uh, your client is actually going to have to create the account and approve it. And if it were like a seller who wants to do it, you know, pay through closing, you can click on um, pay at close, and then you can put in the title company information, and then we'll collect payment from the title company at the end. That's really nice, because a lot of times half the battle is they don't have the money to do the repairs up front. Yeah. Um, so yeah, like once they approve it, then again, we do, we start this uh, sourcing and the scheduling, and then we'll work with the client. Or if the home's vacant, then we'll work with the vacant or we'll work with the agent um, to get into the home and get everything done. So do you guys have lockbox access if it is vacant that you can get a CVS code and get in? No, um, I think through the MLS that they wouldn't let us. Um, I have access. <laughs> I have actually met um, our territory manager out at a vacant property before to let them in. But um, yeah, typically typically you'll let them in the first time and then we can put like a, a CV lock or a CV code, just a, you know, combo code, I should say, yeah. um, um, to get everything done. And then at the end, we would take it off. And so it just depends on whether um, you can click here and then that'll take you directly to punchlist.com where you can create your account. But I'm going to stop sharing now, if that's okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, and on the renovation project, I'm working on one right now in North Scottsdale. <clears throat> um, so we'll bring out our territory manager, our general manager. We'll bring in the contractors, do all the measurements up front. Um, you know, select the materials, get approval from the client, and then start the work. Um, the other thing that I like is if you have a buyer, I mean, that once they close, um, you know, maybe there's large screen TVs or window blinds that they need hung, so, or light bulbs changed, right? It's small things um, all the way up to full-blown renovations. Oh, wow. That's cool. And then I assume like if your buyer, let's say they love the house, but hate the kitchen and plan to demo it, like, are you guys able to give them like a bid so they have an idea of what that's going to cost them? Absolutely. Yeah. Um, they can go to the showroom. They can pick out the materials. Um, we'll price everything, present them with an, again, the online estimate. Um, they can remove line items and um, yeah, so we do all of that work up front and then present them with the price. Where's the showroom located? Well, it depends. So we work with different manufacturers. So there's um, flooring, there's countertops, there's cabinets. Um, we can also like put together a sample board and show them. Uh, we can do like two tier, three tier, you know, here's your low level, uh, mid level, and then top of the line. And then, you know, they can select colors and textures and materials. Yeah. That's really cool. And then I assume like you do stuff, whether they're selling their house or not, like if they, like you were saying, just need some handy work done. Yeah. You guys do that. Cause I actually have my staircases loose and mm -hmm. no one seems to know anyone to fix it. Do you know someone that can fix it? <laughs> um, yeah, so here's the other nice thing about punch list. So we have a vendor management team. If there's areas that we don't have a contractor in um, but need it, they'll go out and source, right? They'll go out and onboard 
new vendors um, that match the items that you need. Yeah, yeah cause it's like not something I can find. Like you, I've asked like our flooring guy and I've Googled and it's just like, it's like they'll put in new banisters, but I don't need a new one. I just need it. I my husband's ankle gave out and he fell into it. And now it's totally loose and wobbly and really not safe, but I can't find anyone to fix it. It's been like this for a couple of years. So when my friends have, my kids have friends over, we're like, don't touch the railing. <laughs> Big yellow tape across it. <laughs> <laughs> don't use it. Stay away from it. <laughs> So in that case, all you would do is um, when, once you create your account, then you can put in a list of repairs, right? Need banister repair or whatever. And then the estimating team will take a look at it. They'll find somebody that can fix it. If they can't, they'll let you know. Okay. It's worth a okay. try, right? Try that because like I said, I can't find anyone. It's like not a thing. People don't do staircase repairs. It's weird. Yeah. I'm like, I'm sure we're not the only people to ever have ours get loose because things happen. People fall, kids, kids are crazy. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, challenge them. <laughs> I'm going to have to. Big I'm be nervous. Yeah. My mother-in-law was going up the stairs and she's holding on to it and I'm watching it wobble and I'm like, oh my gosh, don't touch it. <laughs> it's going to fall. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I, I seriously would just put in their repair banister in this staircase and let's see what happens. <laughs> okay, I'm, going, I'm going to do that. Okay. okay um, thank you. So you got the flyer. Did you get the, the FAQ on the back? Was that helpful? The list of questions and answers? Oh, um, if not, I'll make sure that I get that over to you. I didn't, I didn't have the back. So, okay. That's weird. That's my mistake. Yeah, let me send you the back. We have pre-list flyers, which have different set of FAQs. So on a pre-list, um, I'm sorry, on renovations, <clears throat> I think it's um, ten thousand dollars. There's no deposit above ten thousand is thirty percent. So typically, you want to make sure that there is enough equity in the home. Um, but we'll work with you on the deposit. Okay. Awesome. And how long has Punchlist been in business? I can't believe I haven't heard of this yet. This yeah. Is cool. So actually, um, it started probably four years ago, five years ago in Charleston, South Carolina with a realtor and a contractor. Um, so they thought this would be a great idea. They started putting business plans together, getting some investors. Um, then they got some big investors and they're like, this is too big for you to go get a, you know, go find a CEO. So they found Min Alexander. Um, and then she's really grown the company. So it's, we're a lot on the East coast, like okay. Charleston, Raleigh, um, Nashville, and then went down to Florida and we're just moving West now. So Texas, and I was brought on to open the Phoenix market. Um, oh. So that was in September, but it's growing really quick. And I mean, what a perfect time, right? The market's changed. The sellers are now um, being asked to do repairs. And yep. you know, yeah, they're agreeing to them. <laughs> yeah. No, this is great. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Thank you so much for having me. I appreciate it. Yeah. And, um, Please reach out if you have any questions. I, I really look forward to working with you and your team. Yeah, definitely. I appreciate it. And I will be posting this. And I'm we do have our office meeting on Thursday. So I'll, okay. I'm going to be talking to them a little bit about this and tell them to watch it. It's really good. So since people weren't able to make it. So I appreciate your time. Thank you so much for having me. All right. Well, and, take care. I'll look for your estimate for the repair banister or the institute. Yeah, I'm going to go on and then I'll be a guinea pig for my clients and see yeah. how like how it all works yeah. online because I'm going to see what what you guys come up with. <laughs> Sounds good. Okay. All right. Thank you. Have a good day. All right. You too. Bye. Bye.